My name is Rich O'Connell. I've been with the Trailblazers for six years. The Trailblazers were formed in 1933 and their mission is to work with Washington Department of Fish and Wildlife to stock fish in high mountain lakes. You have to participate on a minimum of three stocking trips throughout the year. You go as an apprentice, so typically you'll be the one that's the mule carrying the fish, but you go with another trailblazer who's been in the club for a while, who shows you the ropes, how to uh, pack fish at the hatchery, um, how to carry them, and then how to release them in the lake. What we look for in a, in a new trailblazer is somebody who's really committed to the fishery, who's fit, you know, willing to go off trail to many lakes, because that's what we do. And somebody um, who has got the right attitude, who wants to do it, who cares about the fishery, and uh, you know, has somewhat of a badass attitude about getting those fish up into the lakes. We have 125 lakes that we typically stock in a year. It's probably six or 700 trail miles. Sometimes it's easy uh, single day trips, sometimes it's multi-day trips. Lots of sweat, lots of commitment, bee stings, bushwhacking everything from um, cliff climbing to um, mountain climbing. The fish are grown in uh, a hatchery and we pick them up as small fry. They're grown in troughs and the hatchery people set them aside into separate uh, containers. We take them from the hatchery into a plastic jug and take that jug in our backpacks where we insulate it, keep it nice and cool, and then drive to the trailhead and then from there, hike as fast as we can to um, get to the lake, um, carefully put the fish in the lake. You know, it's almost like being a parent, right? These are your children sort of swimming out into the world, if you will. You feel like you've kind of nurtured them through the process of getting from the hatchery to the lake and you're releasing them to you know, grow, grow bigger. And hopefully in four years, I'll see them again at the end of my line. I know I've done my job and my duty as a trailblazer when I open that cap and see those fish swimming and uh, I put them in the lake and they swim happily away and start feeding. Recreation is a big part of what we do. We plant fish in lakes so that people can connect with a resource and once they connect with a resource, whether it be fish or whatever it is, they're more inclined to protect the mountain environment and that's really what the club is about. It's not just about fishing and, and stocking lakes, it's about protecting our mountain environment. And we give people a way to do that. My name is Rich O'Connell, I'm 50 years old and I'm a trailblazer. That's me.